What's going on, y'all? This is Big C. Uh, pouring the sweat because it's hot as shit. I'm here doing my laundry, and uh, I was thinking about something. Now, the other night, I watched uh, that Showtime special on the Supreme Team. And let me tell you, with all the dramatics aside, that was a piss-poor documentary. For 20, 30 years or so, we've been hearing all this information on the Supreme Team. I mean, we could go down the list. Kenneth Supreme um, uh, McGriff, uh, uh, Gerald Prince Miller, Bimmy, Black Just, Fat Cat Nichols, uh, Pappy Mason, uh, the murder of uh, Officer Edward Burns. Listen, there was more information on YouTube than there is in that documentary. And one of the main things I've seen in that documentary, I've seen they left Bimmy out who was one of the main members of the Supreme Team. How, how do you leave him out? Um, I'm thinking maybe that's because of his association with 50 Cent. So, you know, maybe they felt some type of way. But honestly, um, you know, I give Nas his props for doing it and for trying to narrate it. But in my heart, I truly believe that they could have found a better narrator. I think they left so much of the story uh, uh, unfinished. They didn't, like, they didn't get to a lot of the intricate parts of the story. But most importantly, the energy level... Um, they didn't take you to where a lot of the shit happened at. They didn't go in depth into the whole situation. I think there's been more information just in rap songs about the Supreme Team than it was in the documentary. And I get it. I understand it might have been an opportunity for somebody to make some money, uh, somebody to open up the doors in um in Hollywood or, or to get a production deal. But the truth of the matter is, there's more information on the Supreme Team going on the internet or reading a newspaper clipping than that documentary gave. And I think they gave it, they tried to shed light in a certain direction about uh, Prince Miller. But the truth of the matter is, I just think they could have did a better job, should have been more informative. See, there's always two sides to the coin. And I think sometimes when you only try to, you know, put 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 uh, dressing on a, on a story, you're not going to get the full content. Listen, this is the Supreme Team. This is one of the biggest drug conglomerates of the 80s and the early 90s. And I just think Showtime bought a already pre-made documentary, and I just think it was a piss-poor job. Listen, I think they could have did better. Yo, once as always, be good to yourselves, be good to others, and more importantly, be good to yourself. This is Big C on YouTube. Subscribe, hit the like button, the share button. You know, um, I'm just new at this. I'm trying to get my little flow going, so work with me. And y'all have a good day. Peace.